Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying three beverages that we found at World Market. These were $1.49 each. Uh, I have the Hollywood Original Shirley Temple Soda Pop. Uh, the Sioux City Prickly Pear and the uh, New Grape Soda. So we're gonna, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about each one. Why don't we try the Shirley Temple first? Hollywood's Original Shirley Temple. Take a stroll down memory lane and sit at the grown-ups table as you sip on a classic Shirley Temple soda pop. As a child movie star, Shirley Temple would be dining among adults and due to her age, could not drink what they were served. The Shirley Temple drink was said to have been created for her. In 1987, Hollywood's Original Shirley Temple soda pop was first produced. This iconic drink has withstood the test of time and is still enjoyed by children of all ages. One bottle is 140 calories. I remember um, our church parties when we were, when I was a teenager, well, you were a teenager, mm -hmm. she would always make Shirley Temples. It's like cherry. The one she made was cherry. No, that does have a, a cherry. It does taste like cherry. Yeah. How did yeah. she make them? Uh, I think she took like cherry flavored um, carbonated soda. Right. And like ginger ale or. Oh, okay. Or, uh, or Sprite or, or, or something like that. Or something like that. Just mix them together. Oh, okay. okay. Put cherries in it. I can <laughs> honestly say I've never had one before. Yeah. This is the first time ever. It's good. I actually like the one she made better. Oh, really? <laughs> from my memory from 100 years ago, I think I like that one better. But that's good. This is sweet, but there's a um, there's a little bit of a of an edge to yeah, it. There's sure. a, um, a little tartness. Yeah, there's a tartness to it uh, with that sweet. Almost there's almost more tart than there is sweet. I agree. But you do taste the cherry, and does have a good flavor, um, and there is sweetness there. So, but it's not one that I would want all the time. Right. Just because yeah, that agree. tartness. Yeah, but it's good. But it is good. Yes. And I think it's interesting that this was created for her and the reason why uh, mm -hmm. is because she was always with the adults and she couldn't drink. Right. I think that's very interesting. Okay, the next one we're gonna try is the Sioux City Prickly Pear Soda. It says imbibe in the taste of the Wild West with the unique flavor of prickly pear sweetened with pure cane sugar. This refreshing treat uh, has a fun pink color and a one-of-a-kind one flavor, making a delightful drink for parties. One bottle is 165 calories. It's more red than pink. So 140, 165. I know, to me, the Shirley Temple's, well, it's kind of peachy. So, mm. this, this, yeah, this is red to me. Yeah, I guess it has a pink tone once you drink, once you see it in the light. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's one-of-a-kind. Hmm. That's it's interesting. <laughs> I don't yeah. think I'd want to drink a lot of that. No. It's not... It's not like horrible. I like know I made a face. It's not the most that. terrible thing I've ever drank, but it's it, not something... Yeah, I don't care for it. It's, there's, um, a, there's a bitterness there. It's bitter. It, and it, even though you're, it's a drink, I know it doesn't make sense, but even though you're drinking something... It almost makes your mouth dry. It almost makes it feel dry. Mm. And it just, yeah. it's not good. No, I don't so really like that one. So, if that's what prickly pear tastes yeah, like, don't want I don't want anything to do with prickly pear. Um, I don't like that one. I haven't ever had prickly pear. Mm -hmm. I've had regular pears, of course, uh, but not uh, that breed. Um, yeah, I do, I do, I just don't care for that. It is, uh, there. it's better, yeah. I don't like that. It'd but be a taste you'd have to grow up with. There is still sweetness in it, but it's primarily bitter. Mm -hmm. So I have high hopes for this one because I love grape. Yeah, grape. This is called New Grape. Uh, even though it's old grape now, because <laughs> it's been around for a while. The New Grape brand was created in 1906 in Atlanta, Georgia, with New Grape Soda bottled in 1921. The Pure grape flavor is apparent as soon as you open a bottle, giving you a sweet, natural grape flavor with a clean aftertaste. One bottle is 200 calories. You can smell the grape, though. Oh, yeah. 200 <laughs> calories, though. Yeah. 
That's very nice. Honestly, for as many calories as it has, I expected it to be sweeter. I did too. Like, yeah. like a crush, a grape crush. Yes, well. exactly. If you're comparing that to grape crush, grape crush is sweeter. Yeah. Then it has more of a grapey flavor too. Yes. Almost so, like a grape juice. The yes. orange crush. I mean the grape crush. The grape crush. So if you're used to drinking grape crush, then I think you're gonna like it better because yeah. it is stronger grape and it's sweeter. That this is very good. It and is if, good. If you haven't had a grape crush, then you would probably be very content with that. Mm -hmm. Out of the three, definitely that's my pick. Yeah, it is um, good too. Yeah, because I, it does have a great flavor. It's just that if you have any knowledge of Grape Crush at all, you're going to say you like the Grape Crush better if you want that powerful, great flavor. Um, I would never buy the Prickly Pear no. again, though. It's no just, I think that's one of those uh, flavors that it's a specialty thing that only certain people are going to like that. And the Charlie Temple was okay. It wasn't bad. It wasn't um, bad. It was, I wish they had a stronger cherry flavor instead of that bitterness in yeah there. i do too it's still good yeah yeah the definitely the best one out of the three was the new grape but it was fun going in world market they have all kinds of uh -huh. uh, bottles to choose from and it was fun for us just to pick out um uh, bottles of things to try so that might be a new thing that kevin and i do uh, because we have seen bottles like this at home goods as well yeah. and we've just never done that so that might be something that we start doing more of is finding drinks like this so this was fun so i hope you all enjoyed it if you did let me know in the comments below if you enjoy getting to hear about them and if you've had any of these if you've had prickly fair let us know what you thought about it and thanks for watching